guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm gonna be doing another Primark haul. So it's gonna be quite long, so I'm gonna try on clips as well. So if you wanna see what I got, then please keep on watching. The first thing I picked up, guys, I'm literally so excited for, cause it's just amazing. Ah. <laughs> it's this inflatable giant float. It's over a meter big, long, wide, both ways, you know, height. 12 pounds is this pegasus he's got glitter all in his wings and all that so basically he's amazing and he was 12 pounds i look at these online all the time because i'm sad and i want to get on holiday stuff together and they're like 40 50 quid so i think that's an absolute steal i picked it up and mum's like oh are you buying that for chloe chloe's my niece and i was like no <laughs> i was like chloe can come on it yes but I'm buying it for me because this is really cool. So yeah, picked that up, £12. They didn't have many left though, so head down to Primark if you wanted to grab that because I know these are quite cool and I feel like these things sell out quite quickly just because of how much more expensive they are online. So yeah, I think they had these, a flamingo, a penguin, and then they had like donuts and stuff. But I think this one was the cutest one, so I grabbed this one. So if you've watched any of my clothing hauls before, I always say I'm not a fan of colour, I'm a bit of a colour phobe. But I picked this up because I actually really like this. So it's this orange... Like, I guess it's a crop or sort of like just waist length. It's got um, these flower details. It's like pink, orange and blue. And then it's got this ruching. Can you see that? And then that tie detail. So you can tighten it so it's a bit bit higher and stuff. So you can fit, make it fit to you. I got this as a size 10 and this was only £6. So I thought, I don't know if the, cus the customer? <laughs> I don't know if the, I don't know if the camera's doing it any justice. But I thought this was so cute and it's a really nice fabric. So yeah, I really like that. I thought for £6 I could chuck it on anything. So I thought, why not add a bit of colour to my wardrobe? Because everything is black, white, grey, nude, so as you can tell. Okay, so this one they had really limited sizes, so I'm guessing it's already popular. So if you want it, then I'd head down and grab it this weekend if you can. God, I actually sort it out, hun. It's this white um, front tie detail, and it's got like orange, blue, pink flowers on it. Um, I got this in a size 12 because I didn't have a size 10, and this was £8. But this is a really nice length. It's like, obviously you'll see it in the try on clip. But it's sort of a crop, and it just ties up at the front. But sometimes when things tie up at the front, I feel like there's not enough material there, and I just feel really exposed. But... This is actually a really good amount and the material is really like light. It's a cotton sort of material. So I thought that would be really cute for holiday. So you'll see that on me in a minute. Okay, so the next thing I got is the same as the last thing I just showed you. But I'm a spanner and you know what Primark's like, you pick something up and on the hanger it says your size and then when you actually look at the tag, it ain't your size. So, this is a size 16, but I might be able to work with it, I don't know, you'll see in the try clip. If there's a clip, I sorted it, we're all good, but if there's not then it was far too big. So, this was also £8 obviously because it's the same top. I think I prefer this print though, so it's like this pastel blue and it almost reminds me of like Hawaiian sort of vibes and so it's yellow and pinks again the exact same concept up top just with this tie detail at the front i just love these like even if you was to chuck this on around the pool eight pounds so is that a still or is that not a still or you could wear it out for a nice meal or just cash if you're going to a karaoke bar you know like you do on holiday you do all these things that you wouldn't normally do so yeah i grabbed that and i love that but like i say there was hardly any sizes left so if you do like these I haven't even tried these on yet, so I, I might not even like them. But um, if you do like these, now definitely head down and grab those first. Okay. Excuse the mess of this next thing because I just chuck everything in a bag and leave it screwed up and then it really needs an iron but your girl doesn't have time for that so it's a bit creased but this is just a it's really stretchy really nice like ribbed stretchy fabric it just says hug me on the front and it's this sort of like mauvey pinky colour with white stripes and it's got these frill detail sleeves 
and yeah this is in a size 10 five pounds and it's that waist sort of length again so if you just wear high-waisted jeans you best tuck it in slightly or like tie it up at the front in a little knot something like that but i really like the bottom of this as well if i can show you properly my hair's really annoying me can i point out by the way where have my roots gone they've disappeared because i got my hair done didn't i yes loving it loving it um anyway back to the video actually back to what what we came here for so it's this frill detail bottom as well as the sleeve so yeah i really like that and five pounds it doesn't feel like it costs five pounds really nice really stretchy and it'll go with anything so yeah pick that up so i grabbed quite a lot of denim in this video so prepare yourselves although i feel like primark have really stepped up that strapped i'm not going to go into this whole thing about i can't speak on youtube again because every single video we've had this issue but you're right they have really stepped up the denim game so first thing i got was this ripped denim skirt in a size 10 let me do it up so yeah it's just this ripped detail and i just love the bottom it's really like ragged it's almost like big kind of looks like my dog's attacked it if i'm honest but i quite like it so i think i'm gonna keep it it's like this ragged how would i say this without making it sound like it's awful because it's actually really nice and i'm saying ragged actually that's not that's not a good uh that's not a good word to describe things but yeah so it's just this really ragged detailed hem as we can see and then it's got the rips on the legs of the skirt this sort of it's like an acid wash i guess i guess i'm not really good at washes of denims like it's either dark or light or black so yeah and then we got these ripped pockets size 10 and this was 12 pounds what a bargain is that because if you used to go to a brand or top shop or something this would definitely be 30 pound plus so how much did i say 12 pound that's so good the only thing I would say again, I've got the problem, but I feel like I always have this problem anywhere. The way, like when I get it on, it fits, but Jesus Christ, it's like a full on workout getting it on. The bum and the hip area is very tight, but when it's on, it fits good. It really like hugs you, but getting it on, girl, let me tell you, you're going to lose some weight getting it on because it's a mission and a half if you've got the same issue as me. Okay, so I picked up another denim skirt. Can you tell that I just don't want to be in this country and I want to be on holiday and wearing hot clothes? We're meant to get a, um, a month's worth of rain on Monday, guys, just to let you know, just to depress you a little bit. But anyway, so I've got this A-line denim skirt and it's just got this flower, white flower embroidery on the sides, um, it's on both sides, and then it's got a raw hem on the bottom. I just really like this. I like the fit of it as well, because it's not going to be too tight. It sort of goes out, it's an A-line. Is it A-line? yeah it's an a-line mini skirt so yeah again got this in a size 10 i believe this was the same price as the last time yeah 12 pounds as seen in glamour magazine so i feel like that's good anyway but yeah so i really like that different wash of denim as well that's what i told myself when i picked it up because i thought do you really need two denim skirts and i said actually they're two different colors so of course you do pick them both up so yeah got both of those Okay, so I think this is, no, this isn't the last thing done. Oh my God, let's not lie. I love these. These are so nice. And I've seen these everywhere at the minute, this sort of style jean. So I thought I'd pick them up. I had to get these in a size 12 just because their jeans are normally really tight on me. Um, but again, the waist is too big now. I've got them in a 12, but so we'll see. So these were 17 pounds. So a bit more than the last ones, but I really like them. So it's these jeans here and they've got this white and black stripe on the outer of the leg um raw hem i really like those and you can see they're really stretchy they've got a really good stretch them so they're so comfy my only issue is one the waist is a little bit too big and two the mid-rise 
I don't think I've worn mid-rise for a few years now so we're gonna have to get used to that but I'm not complaining because they're comfy and I really like them and I feel like I can just give myself a wedgie and pull them up a bit higher so it's fine. Anyways, they're a good length, really good stretch and they're just a bit different. I don't have anything like this so yeah, really like those. Okay, so the next thing I got, I can't believe I found this in Primark. I'm not even kidding. Like, you see this on Instagram people all the time. You know, there's really fit Instagram models. And I just left this. So these are the bikini bottoms. The front does look tiny, to be fair. So I'm not sure that's going to be like on. Um, it's just got this gold ring detail here. Um, the back is quite small as well. I think they're like cheeky sort of ones. Um, I got these in a size 10 and these were £4. Like for a whole bikini, how much did I pay? So for a whole bikini, this was £10, and I feel like this is so in at the minute, this sort of thing. So it's just a triangle top. I just love the colour as well. It's that really good tone of nude, especially if you're tanned. This would look so nice. It's just a triangle detailed um, bikini, and it's got a bit of padding. You can see in there, it's just the thin one, but it's not padded. If, you do, if you're not comfortable with not having much padding, then this probably isn't for you, but I'm good with that. So yeah, I really like this. Um, I got this in a 10 and the bottom's in a 10 and the whole bikini was a tenner. So you can't really go wrong, can you? Because you would definitely pay like 30, 40, well, probably like £30 for this online. So that was a steal and I love this. Hopefully it fits though. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Okay, so the next thing I picked up, I've seen these everywhere. And I always look on um, Fashion Over because they have loads of these. So these are like the, what sort of length would you call these? Okay, I guess they're like knee length. But these are so stretchy, like so stretchy. And I thought I'd get these, just to see if I like them instead of buying them on Fashion Over first. So yeah, I'm gonna try these. Um, these were at £10 and I thought maybe if I do like them, I might like distress the hem a bit more so they're a bit more edgy, look a bit more like Fashion Over. So I can just be like, yeah, I got these from Fashion Over there. So yeah, these are really nice. Got these in a 12, but again, they've got that stretch to them. So I think they're gonna fit really snug. So on that note, I got the exact same ones, but in this bleached sort of colour. I think I prefer these ones just because I normally prefer a lighter denim. They have, again, like the distress in. And again, I think I'll distress the um, hems of them. Excuse me. I'm just so look a bit more edgy, a bit more, I don't know, you know what I mean? I just think I prefer them. So yeah, they're really nice. And the stretch on these is amazing. So if you're like me and you see them on the fashion I think like Khloe Kardashian wore them like last summer and stuff and everyone was buying them off Fashion Over but I mean if I like these then I'll definitely go buy some more but I don't know if the style is going to suit me blah 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 so yeah I'll try these first and they're still anyway they were £10 each so can't go wrong Okay, so I got one more bikini. Um, this is another triangle bikini. And again, this whole bikini was six pounds, uh, six pounds, I wish, 10 pounds. So I got the bottoms in a size 10 and it's just like this blue and it's like a peachy pinky color stripe, like zigzag detail. And then the top is just this triangle top. No padding really, a little bit around the outside, but other than that, not a lot. Um, got this in a size 10 and this, this, this. This was six pounds, so bottoms were four pounds. These was, actually, come on, get them all sale for when I tangle. So yeah, this was six pounds, bottoms were four pounds, and I love this. You can't really go wrong with a 10 pound bikini. So I say to my mum, whenever I go on holiday and stuff, my bikinis always lose color, like from the sun and the chlorine and all of that. So if you pay a tenner for a bikini, you don't really mind, do you? Compared to like, if you was gonna buy one from like Bow Avenue or something, they're like 40 quid. So yeah, still, I'll probably buy some more from there, but I'm happy with those two so far. So going off clothing, I love these next bits, they're so cute, guys. Okay, I'll show you this one first. The next thing I got, so this is like homeware. So if you don't like homeware, guys, I'm sorry, I'm gonna bore you for the next couple of minutes. But this is a Fumper Fro. It's so cute. And it's so fluffy. I would wipe my face in it, but then it'll be orange and we don't want that. So this was six pounds. 
bargain right there. Don't, do I even need to say any more? Because it's six pounds, you know? So that's like the pattern on the fro. So this is a single size, so I think for the double it'll be about eight, ten pounds, but still, that's so good. And it's so cute, especially if like a little kid's room or something. This is gonna be for our spare room, so if my niece stays or anything like that, she'll love this. So yeah, very cute and adorable, and I love it. I think everyone's a sucker for Disney though, aren't they? And Primark's Disney game is strong. Like their, their Disney game is strong. And I couldn't stop there with the fun could I? So I had to get the matching bedding. How freaking cute is this? So it's literally, it just says sweet dreams. It's got a picture of Fumper and like some pink leaves and stuff on it. That's what it looks like there. Um, so it's a single duvet cover and it comes with the pillowcase as well. But that's going to look so cute as a set. So yeah, my niece will love that. And I kind of brought it for myself too because it's really cute. And this was £15, so a bit more, but I feel like you'd pay a lot more than that. So if you were to get this in a Disney store or something, it would cost a lot more than that. So yeah, I love that. And I actually think that's quite a good deal. Okay, so my last things are not that interesting, I'm not going to lie to you, but I think they're really cute. So they are these 40 LED lights for the in for the indoors, for indoors, and they were £2.50. And I've just got these for like um, my background, just to change it up a bit, because I'm getting really bored of just sitting in front of a plain white wall, do you know what I mean? Who wants to see that? Because not me. Hence the sofa in the background today. Does that make it a bit more interesting? So, yes. These are pretty cool, nothing else to say about them really. They're £2.50 and you get 40 of them, so I feel like that's quite a bargain. And they're battery operated, in case you were wondering. That's everything, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, if you did enjoy this video, then please smash a thumbs up. I hope it wasn't too long. I know I ramble a lot, but that's me and I can't help it. Um, yeah, comment down below if you've got any other video ideas for me and subscribe if you haven't already. But yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!